and happy holidays. And to wrap up this dumpster fire of a year, let's review a dumpster fire art toy by 100% soft. Well, this is not their regular dumpster fire minifigure. This is a slightly larger nightlight version. So let's go ahead and check out the package. So we have this nice illustration on here of the glowing dumpster fire uh, in sort of an alleyway in front of a city. On the side, we have the cute image of the trash and all that with the bleak message, the end is near. And then on the back, and one thing to point out, even though the box was not damaged, there is a little bit of a crease in the package they sent me. Uh, the box material is a little bit thin compared to some figures I've gotten in the past, but it mentions what it is, BPA free, uh, tap to activate, all that sort of thing, as well as it takes three AAA batteries, which are not included. And then we have some cuteness here with a butt that looks a little bit like a certain president with a toupee that we may know of. And then the top and bottom. So let's go ahead and get this all package and see if it's worthy of our collection. And here we have the dumpster fire out of the package, and I think it looks pretty great. Now, of course, it's rotocasted like most vinyl figures. Uh, it's a bit larger than the smaller uh, figurine that you may have seen in comic shops uh, or on their website. And it appears to be multiple pieces. So we have the main body of it, which seems to be all casted from a single piece. The flame up here looks like it's another piece altogether. And then down here in the battery compartment seems to be more of an ABS type of plastic compared to the typical vinyl that we have. Uh, but yeah, the details are nicely sculpted. Uh, looks like they have good casting in here. Got the logo on the back. The wheels underneath. The wheels aren't 100% even, but they're good enough. There's a little bit of a wiggle there, but nothing too major, uh, especially if it's just left on a shelf. It's all, it's stable enough considering how large it is. A little bit of paint application on the dumpster lids. And the application itself is pretty good. I mean, it's a little bit of slight over coverage on the ends here, but the overall build quality of this, I think is pretty great. Uh, I think it's a great design, it's cute. I do wish this had an option for the mask, like one of the figures did, uh, as this is 2020 where everyone is wearing their mask. So let's go ahead and see how it looks with the lights off. And with the lights off, all we have to do is press on the lid and he lights up. And I think that is a really nice glow coming from this figure. You can sort of see a little bit of the inconsistency of the thickness of plastic that happens in the rotocasting process, but nothing sitting out that looks poorly made. One thing I really like about this is the fact that the figure itself has a constant glow, but they have put a flicker into the flame. I think that is a really nice touch that is a little soothing considering what this figure represents. But we can go ahead and rotate it and see how the rest looks here but i think they did a great job with this i think this was a better purchase than the smaller figure considering one it's a light two it looks just as cute and well made as the smaller figure and is larger and three it's not that much more expensive so like always let us know below if you think this truly represents the dumpster fire that is 2020 and if it's worthy of your collection and like always happy holidays and we'll see you all next time